Hi guys, welcome back to my kitchen. Today we're going to make lobster bisque with some leftover lobster heads and some lobster legs. We're going to make a mirepoix soup base. Mirepoix is a sautéed mixture of diced vegetables consisting of celery, carrots, and onions. It's one of the most traditional flavor bases for soups and stocks. So right here, I'm dicing up some celery and then I'm going to dice up some carrots. It's important to dice up the vegetables to roughly the same size. That way, they will cook evenly when we saute them. And I'm going to dice up some onions here. I'm using the whole onion. Usually, Mui uses around 2 parts onion to 1 part celery and 1 part carrot. And now we've got our diced vegetables, some onions, carrots, and celery. I'm gonna use some tomato puree and it's gonna explode. Okay, be right back. Anyway, these things always happen. So we're opening up a can of tomato puree. I always look for tomato purees with no added sugar. So this one is really good. We're only going to use about half a can. Prepare your pot and we're going to use about a tablespoon of butter. We're going to let that melt for a while. Next, we're going to saute our vegetables. So in goes the onions and then the celery. And then in goes the carrots. So we're going to mix it all up and sweat out the onions and cook them for a little while. After about 2 minutes, now we're ready to put in our minced garlic. It's just 2 cloves of garlic. Just mince it up really small and then put it in the pot. Now we put in our tomato puree. Just pour everything in and give it a quick mix. Next, we're going to sprinkle in some all-purpose flour. This will create a really nice and thick consistency. And what we're going to do here is we're just going to coat all the vegetables with flour. Now we're going to pour in our lobster stock. Lobster stock is just basically the lobster heads and the lobster legs boiled in water. And usually, it only takes about 30 minutes to extract all the flavors out of the lobster heads. Don't forget to season with sea salt and season generously. We're going in with an immersion blender to blend all the carrots, celery, and onions so that it will become a smooth, thick consistency for the soup. Next, we're going to add some heavy cream into the soup. You can use whipping cream, heavy cream, cooking cream, any kind of cream. Give it a quick mix. And if you think that's not enough, you can just add a little bit more. So since I've used up all my lobster meat in the previous video, I'm going to put in some juicy and big shrimps. Let the shrimps cook for a while in the soup and then fish them out. If you think the soup is still a little bit grainy, you can go in again with your immersion blender to blend it all to make it smooth. And then we're going to serve it up and ladle some into our bowls. Don't forget to put our plump and juicy shrimps in. What I did is I just cut them into small chunks and put it in the soup. Next, we're going to go in and give a little swirl of the heavy cream to give it a good garnish. And for a final touch, some cracked black pepper. Thanks for watching everyone!